Look, I think two things. One is that there is an understanding that these environmental regulations are inevitable. They're in place and they're not going to be going anywhere. They're a fact of life. The second part was that it's still a very new situation. It's a new environment that we're living in. There are a lot of people are asking a lot of questions and, and people are struggling and sort of helping each other to find what the consequences of these regulations, that these regulations are inevitable. This is the world that we're living in. We either have to evolve with them and find opportunity in them or they will push us aside. I think it's very critical and I, and I think that it's more about starting conversations. It's about because this is a new environment that we're all trying to work through, where the consequences are still unknown and where the end results are, are still opaque, people coming together and having them describe what they're doing and what they're experiencing. I think that helps to create collective solutions. And this is something that, again, we don't know, right? Will this stop? Will there be political uh, uh, political uh, opposition and have it be rolled back? This is the exciting part about this environmental context that we're living in now. And this is why these seminars are important, because people will come with different viewpoints, different experiences, different understandings, and there's a consensus that can be built as to where will this all end up? where as individuals living in very sort of anatomistic lives, we don't know. Yeah, look, I thought it was super insightful and uh, very, very interesting.